iPad. There we go. There we go. There we go. Sweet. I think we're all set. I think we're all set. Welcome, welcome everybody. Hope you are well. Just drinking my soda water. What's up? I need to find a place to put this phone. Because now I can't read. There we go. Daniel, what's up? Good to see you. <coughs> welcome, welcome. Uppings of the what? Huh? <laughs> what? Mr. Noir, good evening. <laughs> yes, Noir Ombre from Yusuke Miyake. What's up, Brady? What's up? Best fragrance for summer, I would go Masoni Wave. Any new fragrances? Funny you should ask. I got two samples right here that were sent to me. I got a 30 mil of a fragrance that a company here in KC, I was able to get like a $25 gift card. So I got this to try out. I got this one, which I have not unboxed yet. Hello from Leono Richie. One of the followers on TikTok wants me to smell this one really badly. And then I assume the one that everyone is waiting for. Greenlee's in here. And Blockade and um, Greenwich Village. So we will see. Best seat of rhythm besides Miami. I mean, of the four that I got, I'll go St. John. Smelled angel shirts today for the first time at Sephora. It smelled like a caramel apple pie. That's what I keep saying, bro. It's like the best apple caramel pie you've ever smelled. Yeah, Nick. Samples came. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Cannot wait to test them out. Cannot wait. Spice Bomb. Uh, Extreme's probably the best one, but infrared's so good. I got Creed Imper uh, Milcine Imperial. Is that the best in the lineup? Heard it was. Uh, I mean... Personally, I like Viking, but like I get it. It smells like um, uh, Old Spice, so it's kind of hard when you're justifying paying that much for like an Old Spice. Milicine Imperial, a lot of people love. Uh, thought on Hugo Boss's scent, Le Parfum. Haven't smelled it. I would like to, though. What's up, Lena? Favorite cologne you have in your collection? La Mal Le Parfum. Love it. Best fragrance that projects well and lasts all day. Um... Like, Sauvage works. I know a lot of people have, like, a lot of hate on Sauvage. Sauvage works. You could do uh, Prada Loam Intense. That works. Uh, regular Lamal. I mean, it depends on all day. If you're talking about, like, eight hours, regular Lamal works. Spartacus works. Um, Dylan Blue, that only goes, like, ten hours. I wouldn't do Dylan Blue. I would live in Mint for Mint. Sarah's a good one. Joma Shop Cart right now. Lamal Labor Farm starting with you intensely. Fecal Dio Melfi and Instant Crush. Awesome. Let me know if you get them. Oh, thank you for the gift. Appreciate it. Mayor, what's up? Good to see you. Oh, thanks for following, bro. What's up, media? I'm so sad about my Bohemian Line atomizer. I know, man. That really sucks. I had to go through almost all of my atomizers to see which one fit. So I had to spray like six different fragrances multiple times. My room was nuclear. <laughs> I get that. I get that. My day's been good, Bryce. It's been very busy. I thought it wasn't going to be as busy, but it was. Unpopular opinion, I smelled Born in Roma and didn't like it. Very sad about that. Ah, too bad, man. But again, there isn't one fragrance that everybody likes. Edwin, thanks for the rose. Mayor, thanks for the gift. Best fragrance line in the mall, in my opinion. Bad Boy Cobalt, it smells so good. It's like a... Um, it's almost like a fresh, like I get like a fresh citrus sweet fragrance, if that makes sense. It's not like a heavy citrus. Dimitri, thanks for following. So it's not like a heavy citrus, but it has that like sweetness. Sweet, thanks for following. Scandal Pour Home is good. Arrow's Flame, I like it. I didn't used to really like it now. Speaking of bad atomizer, John Barbato's Arts and Teal is horrible. I haven't even smelled that one. Need to. Daniel, thanks for the gift. Side effect. Um, I don't think it's worth it, to be honest. Chris, what's up? Blue to Chanel, EDP is the best one. Oh, thank you, Daniel, for the gift. Have I macerated fragrance? I mean, I, I mean I've, I've sprayed them. They've sat on my shelves, you know, if that's what we're talking. I haven't done anything special with any fragrance bottles. Uh, hi, Eddie. Like it. I like it a lot. Best summer fragrance, Missoni Wave. I sprayed Sauvage Elixir on me two days ago at Ulta. Washed my hoodie. I can still smell it. Yeah, it won't go off your clothing for a while. Uh, best summer fragrance, any price. I mean... 
I still think Masoni Wave is fire. Like, Elysium's really good if you want to spend a lot of money for a niche. I don't know that Elysium will get you more compliments than Masoni Wave, though. Uh, Hawass is good. Uh, Dylan Blue is good. Um, now, again, if we want an expensive one, Elysium's my favorite uh, fragrance for the summer if we're going, like, niche. Uh, you could also go Percival. Uh, it fell off my shelf and landed on the atomizer at an angle. Just lobs the fragrance out like a water gun. Poor Dylan Blue has been downgraded. <laughs> Are you ready? You mentally prepared? No, I'm not. I'm not, bro. I'm really not. But let's do it. <laughs> Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. Oh, Intense is good. Uh, Hawass Notes. I don't know. I haven't even looked at the notes, to be honest. If you're interested in Gunna, you could go to Fragrantica. Fragrantica will have all the notes for Hawass. Just literally go on to Google, type in uh, Rosasi Hawass, and it'll be one of the top links. Uh, my favorite fragrance is La Molle Profonde. CT, what's up? What do I think about Zerzhov Herba Pura? I uh, haven't gotten it yet. I'm getting it hopefully this week, but it'll probably come like when I'm gone. I leave on uh, Friday, and I have fragrances that seem to be arriving Friday and Saturday. So I'll have to wait till I get back on uh, Monday. Chiefs for life. Thanks for the gift. My favorite JPG, La Molle Profonde. Uh, what do I think about Herba Pura? I haven't smelled it yet. Any caramel fragrances, not Azaro. I mean, you could go starting with Uline. You know, it smells very similar. You could go the Scandal line. Um, trying to think. There was one I was just saying the other day. It was like caramel. Oh, if we went with the new uh, Camera, the one with coffee, it's like a caramel coffee. Uh, what's up, Meline? Hello. Do I got Latafa Asad? I do. One of my followers sent me a uh, sample of theirs. It's really good. Very similar to Sauvage Elixir. Lasts about seven hours, give or take. Rasasi Dereje, or Dereje, or how you say it. I haven't smelled that one. I haven't smelled that one. Oh, thanks for following the channel. Appreciate it. What happened to my arms? Oh, nothing. I was just born this way. That's all. Mont Blanc Explorer is my favorite Aventus type fragrance. Favorite Gucci? Um, it might be an Intense Oud. I really like that one. Uh, try out Dior Elixir and Dior EDP, best to last thing. I mean, Dior Elixir, Sauvage Elixir, it just does not die. It's a great fragrance. Got strength again, but this time I actually deserve it. Dang, CT. Oof. Malachi, thanks for following. Blue de Chanel Parfums, okay. I think EDP is better. Best clone under 40. Uh, Hi, Eddie. You can get it for like 17 bucks. Marcos, thanks for following. 9 p.m. is a good starter. Yeah, I think so. It's a nice one. Personally, I prefer Rom Silver. It's a little bit cheaper, but they're both good. TikToker, thanks for following. All right, guys, here's the question. Yeah, I was about to ask if it's Dior Sauvage 2.0. Oh, gotcha, yeah. Designer, semi-popular, masculine, winter scent, you own it. Unique bottle. Top notes are lavender and spices. Middle notes are patchouli. Base notes of vanilla and taco bean. Underrated fragrance. It's a winter designer, semi-popular. I'm assuming that's not all the notes. Lavender and spices. Winter. Semi-popular. Uh, do I like Jordans? I mean, the shoes, some of them are really cool. Mario, what's up, bro? Change your name to the sun? <laughs> uh, by the fireplace, I prefer over Jazz Club. Any niche caramel fragrances? Um, hmm. I mean, you could go um, Angel Share. It's like an apple crum crumble pie. Like, you get that caramel in there. Love your content. All oh, thanks, Walter. You won't believe it. My Tropical Confessions 2ML sample came and broke five minutes in on the floor. Oh, that hurts. That really hurts. I'm sorry. Ugh. Only one note is missing. Is it Iris by any chance? Try it once. Okay. Uh, if I get a chance to, Palman, I'll definitely give a shot for that. <laughs> Talk to the Crips. You're, you're kind of following my line of thinking. I'm assuming he left out Iris. Uh, Cafe Amor is so good. I love Cafe. Or Amor Cafe. I love it. David, thanks for following. Detour Noir. It's very good. Very similar to Leighton. Uh, JPG 6.8 out, uh, ounce bottle. Yes, they have them. I don't have one. I meant to get one. I was going to buy La Molle Profonde 6.8, but I got the 4.1 for like 73 bucks. I'm like, you know, I'll just give it. Afton Terathi Blue. No, I do not. 
Yeah, but is Iris the one note you're leaving out? Out of curiosity. I'm assuming it's iron or um, Iris, or I'm thinking it's tobacco. I think it's one of those two. Do I recommend Coach Platinum? I haven't smelled it. Uh, do I have off the, No, I do not. Uh, Ultra Malt. Good fragrance. I like it. Very good. It's like a pear fragrance. Um, haven't smelled Herb Pure. Get in it soon. Uh, Labole Parfum is good. If it lasts on your skin, it's fire. Haven't smelled Bahra Keen. My favorite fragrance is Labole Parfum. I've tried Obsession by Calvin Klein. Not in a long time. I used to. Haven't in a while. Tropical Confession has a vanilla ice cream uh, type of smell. So good. Worth the hype. Awesome. I'll have to try it. Uh, nine, bond number nine, Lafayette. Haven't smelled it yet. Looking back on it, I'm surprised they only strike me and didn't ban me from commenting. Dang, CT. Holy cow. I'm sorry, bro. Uh, light blue, intense, fire, summer fragrance. The last note is not iris. Okay. So back to the notes real quick. It's lavender, spices, middle notes of patchouli, base notes of vanilla and tonka bean. Underrated masculine winter scent. One last question. Is it a YSL? SpongeBob, haven't smelled it yet. Torino 21, haven't smelled it yet. Posh Omega, love it. So similar to uh, Lamal Essence, fire. Biggie Cheese, thanks for following. Uh, best JPG fragrance for summer. LeBeau, if it lasts on your skin. If not, you're going to have to go like a regular Lamal. Uh, exceptional, offering an exquisite range of scents that captivate the senses. <laughs> thanks, bro. <laughs> My favorite cologne is Lamal Le Parfum. What would you say is the best JPG for summer? Did that already. How do I spray cologne? Uh, I put the bottle on my arm and just use my finger on the atomizer. Uh, I just put out a scent of the day uh, right before this live. If you're curious, go take a look. Hudson, what's up? How are you doing, bro? Uh, Goofy, please don't. Uh, spam, please. Favorite scent? Uh, like notes are uh, spices and leather. My favorite fragrance is La Molle Parfum. Not YSL Elixir. No, I wasn't thinking YSL Elixir. I was thinking an Oud fragrance. Uh, Ida T, thanks for sharing. Invictus Platinum, great fragrance, love it. Majin, thanks for following. How do I feel about Legend Spirit? It's very similar to Invictus Aqua 2016. It's a nice, fresh, sweet fragrance for the summer. Bulgari Man Wood, haven't smelled that in a while. I smelled it at uh, Duty Free in Atlanta. I don't even remember what it smells like, to be honest. Panchito, what's up? Yeah, I was thinking uh, M7 Nude Absolute, though. It was the one I was thinking of. Michael, thanks for following. Uh, Prada Loam, it's a good fragrance. I love it. Beautiful, soapy, beautiful iris. I know, La Molle Parfum is my favorite. It's just, it's it's so bad. I'm in sixth grade and got off at 9 p.m. That's a good one for you. You'll like it. You'll like it. It's a good fragrance. Uh, don't you mind the one's good. EDP is probably the best one, although if you can get Luminous Night, ooh, fire fragrance. LMG, thanks for following. Marcos, thanks for following. I uh, haven't smelled 9 a.m., though. I don't know. I like 9 p.m. Haven't smelled 9 a.m. Oh, yeah. I'll take a hint. Sorry, bro. Sorry. Try, I'm getting, like, bombarded with questions. Happy to answer as many as I can. And still trying to think of what is a winter fragrance with spices and lavender. What's the best scent? Under 80 bucks. Uh, well, so I got La Molle Parfum for 90 or 73. I think it's now 90. Um, I'll, I'll just not say La Molle Parfum. So one that's 80. Um... If you can get uh, Oud Noir from Versace, that's a fire fragrance. I've seen um, Starting With You Leather for that. Uh, you can get Dylan Blue for about 40 Azar The Most Wanted, I think you can get around that. So those are some great options. Phantom, great fragrance, easy to wear. Do I like Carlisle? Love it. It's one of my favorite fragrances from PDM. It's that or Altair. Omwash, Interlude, Black Iris, holy cow, that fragrance is so powerful. Oh, it's like half a spray is all you need. Uh, you got 11-year-old viewers, man. <laughs> Other middle note is incense. Oh, shoot. That doesn't help me at all. Ooh. Have I tried Tony Iommi from uh, Zerzhov? No, I have not. It's weird how my LeBeau ET 75 mil 10 is so much bigger than my Lamal. Yes, I agree with that. Some of the times, like, the Lamal 10s are like, what? Christian JD, thanks for following. Both are 75. That's weird. LeBeau's bottle shape is much bigger. That is true. They did make LeBeau's bottle bigger. When you put them beside each other, you can tell it's a bigger bottle. 
Angel Chair, love it, beautiful. Uh, can you tell me where you got your perfume organizer? Like the, the shelf? Like I just got this on Amazon. Like Amazon, I just looked, in, looked up shelves that were kind of rugged. <laughs> I smelled Aqua Celestia today. Bro, that thing is fire. Awesome, glad you like it. I love it, I think it's so good. Holy cow, I think it's underrated. It's done most money EP intense is okay, performs better. Best one million is Royal. Best place to buy, Joma Shop or E Discount or Fragrance Buy or Aura or <laughs> Fragrance Nevada. Depends on what you're looking for. Best fragrance to be with your girl, La Molly Parfum. Versace Eros, great one. EDP is probably the best one. Pocket Rabanne, 1 million Royal. Love it. Azar, the most one intense is good. What's good, Vivian? Love your stuff. Oh, thank you so much. Appreciate it. I smelled Born to be Unforgettable today. Should I expect the same DNA in Tonka Cola? I haven't smelled Born to be Unforgettable, so I don't know. Tonka Cola smells like... You know when you have like a soda and you left it out for a while and it gets really syrupy? It smells like that syrup with a little bit of sparkle in it. Some say the atomizer of this fragrance is terrible. Wait, Detour Noir? Spices, lavender, incense. It could be. It could be. Dolce Gabbana ADP, good one. I like it. Top three nighttime fragrances. La Molle Parfum. I'm not quite saying La Molle Parfum. Let's just say it's on every list. <clears throat> Let's just say it's on every list. All right, so not La Molle Parfum. I'll go Amore Cafe from Mancera. I would go Spartacus from Harmony. And I would go Strong With You Leather. Initial side effect. I do have it. It's good. It just, I don't smell it on me. It's weird. Like everyone else smells it. I don't smell it. Luminous Night is almost 400. No, it's not. Marcos, you got to be kidding me. I paid 70 bucks for that thing. So Dolce Gabbana, Luminous Night. The one Luminous Night is 400. Whew. How hard man is? Oh. Oh, shoot. You're right. So designer with a terrible atomizer. What designer has a terrible atomizer? I know people think Mugler is, but neither one of those is an incense. That's booze or tobacco. Um, poof. Well, Fragrance Brand is known for having bad atomizer. Think about it. <laughs> and I'm trying, but my brain's not working. What do you think about why I sell ADP? It's a good one. Is Man in Black a good fall or winter? I'd say it's both. I think it leans more fall, but it works great. Can't wait to get the new one. Holy cow, with Iris in it? Yes, please. Uh, what do you think about YSL EDP? Just did that. How do you put on cologne? Put it on my arm and use my finger. One million royals, the best one. It's not the one. It's the special edition Luminous. Oh, gotcha. Good man, Sarah Fragrance for a spring, summer. I would get Sidrap Wazai. That's my scent of the day today. Fire. Uh, best YSL for summer. Uh, Lone Blue Electric. I haven't smelled that, Daniel. I want to. Um, best YSL for a summer. Myself would work. I'm thinking YADP might be the best one. I know they had a summer vibes one, but I can't remember the name of it. What fragrance brands known for having bad atomizers? Paco Rabanne, bad atomizer. They do have bad atomizers, but they don't have incense in it. One second, people. I got to turn around for a second. Because I know when you tell me, I'm going to be like, damn it, how did I not think of that? So Mercedes Benz Club Black. Is that it? But no, that. Oh, jeez. 
Steph, thanks for subscribing, bro. Appreciate it. Awesome. Thanks for the gift. I just got the bottle of Louboutin Imagination. Nice. Let me know your thoughts, Mason, when you get it. Cannot wait. Best budget vanilla Mercedes-Benz Club Black. Not much have atomizers. I know that's the problem. That's what I'm trying to think. Sometimes Versace. Yeah, they can sometimes. One million atomizer. Uh, but it's the incense. I can't think of either one having incense in it. I have Royal EDT. And he didn't say Oud, so it's not the Oud one. Cremo. That's not a bad uh, brand I hear. I haven't smelled any from it. Roberto, thanks for following Kila, thanks for following. Elite Sense, what's up? Just got by the fireplace today. Oh, Steph, I love that fragrance so much. So good. What's up, Gio? There's a no peeling at this time. Wait, what does that mean? Greenly, greenly. It isn't here, but I'm going to do an unboxing video, so we'll have to wait for tomorrow for Greenly. Brent, thanks for following. Have a try for Saucy Hawass Ice. No. This friggin' doesn't have a terrible atomizer, but the rest of them do. It's still not a good atomizer. <sighs> Bro, I, my brain's not working today. I, my, I swear my brain's not working today. Uh... Hold on. Out of curiosity, is it this? Although I think this atomizer is, yeah, it's not the greatest, but I wouldn't say it's a bad atomizer. I don't know. Oh, it smells so good. Like the joke was so bad, but there's no way I'll win the NPL. Oh, gotcha. Oh, that sucks. That's two strikes, bro. That sucks. Follow me on YouTube. That way I don't lose you. <laughs> I actually got a sweet. I still don't think that's a bad atomizer, but I know what you mean. And now I think I have Invictus Victory Elixir in my soda water. Oh, that's gross. That's really gross. Don't do that, people. Don't do that. Polo Green, haven't smelled it, Cole. I mean, it's so old, I haven't smelled it in a while. I, I'll never forget. I was at, I'll never forget. I was in Dillard's, and um, this old guy came in. And he says, do you guys sell Polo Green? And they said, yes, we have it. He says, do you need it? And he says, no, I have a bunch at home. I just want to make sure you have my favorite fragrance. And they said, yes, we have it, sir. And he goes, so do you have like a lot of bottles? He, they go, no, we don't have many. He said, ah, so it's very popular, I see. So people are still buying it all the time. And they're like, yeah, yeah, sir. And I just kept listening to it. And I'm like, don't look at them in the face. Just don't look. Brent, thanks for following. So I honestly, I haven't smelled Polo Green in a while, Cole. I know some people like it. They changed and did a more modern updated one. I hear that one's actually really good. I hear that one's good, but I haven't smelled it. Aqua de Gio, I like Profundo and Absolute. Rayhan, I have Ocean Rush up there, and I have another Rayhan. What is the other Rayhan I have? I don't remember. I have another one. I've been ferreting those really bad fragrance tier lists so I can use them as ideas. <laughs> I like that. I want to make the first drinkable fragrance. Oof. Oof. I will say, like, some of them, if if there's a way you could do it, but I just, oof. I don't know. Anthony, and thanks for following. Best Versace is probably for Ohm or Flame. You know, that's the problem. Like, I like Flame, but it's not a safe blind buy. Poor Ohm is very good. I still think Dylan Blue is the best. I'd go Dylan Blue 1, Oud Noir 2. Uh, Midnight in Paris, no, I want to. I don't have it. Halloween Man X, great fragrance, like Eros and Coffee. Favorite Tom Ford, Vanifa Tal, PDM Percival, great compliment puller, easy. I do not have Santel 33. It's a great fragrance, though. Uh, how does Rayhan perform? So the one I got, it came out in November, so it's a summer scent. I need to test it out in the summer. Starting with you, absolutely great fragrance. Projects heavily. Off on 9 p.m. It's a nice cinnamon spicy uh, Ultra Mall. Uh, Lagman Lime, thanks for following. What do I think about Davidoff Cool Water Intense? Haven't smelled it. I hear it's good, Adrian. I smelled Dylan Blue through the day and almost got it. Uh, why didn't you, Steph? <laughs> so good. Uh, if anyone does want Dylan Blue on my link tree, on my profile, um, I have a great deal with that. So like the very top one on Gemma Shop, they have a great sale uh, price. It's like 40 bucks for Dylan Blue. Yeah, definitely got some of the fragrance in there, unfortunately. So gross. Don't do it, people. Don't do that. G 
Tino, thanks for following. I have Night to Paris, Dark and Motion, Best Perfumes. Nice. I haven't smelled them. Angel's Here is Fire. Best apple chrome pie you've ever smelled. I got to make a backup soon because with the rate I'm going, I'll be banned by the end of March. At the rate you're going, bro, you'll be banned by like the end of the week. <laughs> Raylan, thanks for following. Polo Red Eau de Toilette. It's good. It is good. I actually like it. I also smelled Spice Bump Infrared and it wasn't bad. Yeah, I know what you mean, Steph. Like, I like it. It's really interesting, but you have to think about it. What fragrance are the ones with the antler cap? So they're both Latafas. Um, they're in the Al Noble line. One is Wazir and the other is... <sighs> I can't remember the name of it. I have the green bottle and the brown bottle or, or bronze bottle, bottle. There is a black one. I haven't gotten that one yet. This one's going to be easy. I hope so, Ed, because my brain is not working. Invictus Victory Elixir. <laughs> it smells so good. Doesn't taste good at all. Oh, don't do that, people. Don't do that. Don't do that. Um, but the scent, oh, it's beautiful. It is a compliment puller. I swear I get compliments almost every time I wear this. I need to film a review of this tomorrow, especially with all these other bottles I need to talk about, too. I need to do that one. I keep forgetting. Aeros Flame, good for every day. Yes, but again, I didn't use to like it. Now I love it. Um, it's not a safe blind buy. Make sure you like it first before you get it. Lamal, good for summer. You can wear Lamal in the summer. Yes, you can. Would I rather my Nespresso with a fragrance in it or wear Encre Noir every day till the bottle's empty? Um... Joey, what's up? Um, ooh. Bro, that's like a tough one. I'm going to go wear Encre Noir every day till the bottle's empty. I think that's what I got to do. I think I got to do that one. I wear Invictus Victory, and it's my favorite vanilla fragrance, but I should try YSL Baby Cat. I don't, I don't like YSL Baby Cat. I don't think it's a good fragrance at all. The uh, leather net is really not appealing. It smells kind of like an old man leather fragrance. Um, I don't like it at all. Now, again, I'm sure there are people out there that love it, and they're going to say I'm being really harsh on it, and I'm sorry, but I just I don't like it at all. I was so disappointed. I was excited to get it. I couldn't wait to get it. I actually overpaid a little bit, I think, for it, and uh, I don't like it. Off the 9 p.m., yeah, it's good for school, definitely. All right, so niche, popular, masculine. I own it. Summer scent. Basic bottle, top notes of citrus and spice, middle notes patchouli and fruit, base notes of moss, musk, and vanilla. I'm going with uh, Lyceum Intense. Uh, side effect, good blind bite. Maybe the scent is good. Again, it doesn't perform on my skin. It's weird. Like, everyone can smell it but me. Like, I literally have enough on me for the, everyone around me to smell it, and I just don't smell it. You know, that's a year straight. It's going to be stuck in your skin. <laughs> no, I'm going to do what he said. I'm going to do, like, 80 sprays for an hour and then take a shower, and then do 80 more and then take another shower. I'm going to use up my entire body wash, but that bottle will be gone. Dior Sauvage, it's still a good fragrance. still gets compliments. still lasts long. Great performance. All I'm going to say is that a girl, oh, bro, you did not. Ah, oh, CT. <laughs> CT defending Kanye. <laughs> what is the best $50 fragrance Dylan Blue? You can get it for like 40 bucks. One million royal, fire. Love it. Oh, so it's not... Elysium Intense. Dang, I thought for sure that was it. A niche, a niche summer. Another base note is leather. Okay, so now I'm thinking Labusse because Labusse has leather, but I'm trying to remember if Spartacus has leather. I don't think Labusse has vanilla, but it might. French Riviera, Iowa Lemon Mint, or So Blue. Huh? Doritos? Sorry, I, I didn't catch that. 
<laughs> She's disrespecting my game. I had to show my loyalty. <laughs> Summer fragrance says, Missoni Wave is great. Uh, so I do have a fragrance giveaway if you want a clone. So just go to my profile. It's the only pinned video. Uh, the draw is February 28th. It is quickly getting here. What is it now? The 20th? Wow. Almost time for the draw. Phineas, thanks for following and sharing. Uh, Lebeau DT, great fragrance. Love the coconut. Normal 1 million, still a great sweet fragrance. I still get compliments with it. I like it. Uh, best 1 million, though, I think is Royal. Armani Code, a most underrated line out there. Such a good line. I love them all. Hawass, uh, I would go Missoni Wave over Hawass. Why did you start collecting? I love scents. I love collecting scent. I think it's fun. I love smelling good. Um, oh, which, which man, Sarah is better. Haven't smelled French Riviera. I'm getting it soon. So blue. Haven't smelled it. I love Owl Lemon Mint. It is beautiful. I might be obsessed with Kanye. <laughs> well, I mean, Dak keeps letting you down. <laughs> Juan, thanks for following. Andrew, what's up? Coney, what's up? Thanks for following. Should I get Nautica Voyage? It's my favorite gym fragrance, but that's the only time I wear it, to be honest. Second best one million. Um, probably Lucky. Parfum's good, too. Oh, shoot. Uh, back to that question. Also, I just want you to know my name isn't actually Edward. Edward is a video game character. My favorite of all time. My name is Noah. Oh, good to know. Although, I'll probably keep calling you Ed. <laughs> You're going to be mad about this one. Oh, didn't hear. Prince Ravier is the best man Sarah without a doubt. So hard to find, though. Good to know. I can't wait to smell it. Oh, honestly, bro, I feel like my brain is just shut off. Like, it's a niche summer fragrance that has, oh, what was it again? Where's Asher when you need him? On Crate Noir tomorrow. No, not a chance. Um, a niche popular masculine. I own it. Summer scent. Basic bottle. Top notes of citrus and spice. The spice is what's throwing me off. That's why I thought, um... Uh, Elysium Intense. Middle notes of patchouli and fruit. Base notes of moss, musk, and vanilla. And also leather. A leather niche. What summer niche has leather in it? Best fragrance line, Lamal. Good everyday niche. Uh, Percival. Oh, thanks for following. Appreciate it. Just started live. No, I'm about 33 minutes in. Uh, what do you, what do you get from luxury fragrances? Like, what makes a fragrance worth 400? So, there is an art to fragrances. Like, you want the certain like quality of fragrance. Um, for me personally, I get them on sale. So I have not paid 400 dollars for a fragrance. Maybe one day I will, but at the moment, 300 is the most I've spent. Which again. That's still a lot. I get that, but it was a gift for hitting a thousand followers on TikTok. So I thought I could like get something that was a little bit more fancy that I wouldn't normally get. Um, sometimes they just smell so good, and you want to smell different than other people because you know everyone will have like an Invictus or a Versace, and not everyone will have like an MFK. So <clears throat> you're willing to pay up a bit more, and the quality usually, not always, usually smells better. Sometimes the quality smells worse, like. It's shocking. So for me personally, I go for what's the best fragrance scent. Oh my gosh. Why can't I not think of this niche? Or just blindly grab a random bottle. Oh, what summer niches do I have? I have Italian citrus. There is no incense in Italian citrus. Um, I think all my summers are up here. Um,
I'm going to go Aqua Celestia, though I'm pretty sure it's not Aqua Celestia. I'm just thinking that um, that's the one I'd be upset if that was the one you picked, and I didn't guess it. Good Budget Vanilla, Mercedes-Benz Club Black. City Rhythm, I have Miami, <laughs> St. John, Nashville, and um, Manhattan. I think Miami is the best. The mall review, beautiful barbershop with nice hints of lavender. Do I have any Jimmy Choo? I have two. They smell good. They just don't last long. I'm going to be so mad. I bet I am. <laughs> Take care. Good to see you, Emmanuel. I don't know why, but by the fair place, doesn't last long on my skin. Oh, that sucks, Steph. I love that fragrance. I even looked at Sidra Bozai. I almost said Sidra Bozai. But then I thought, eh, if I don't guess that one. So it was more <laughs> Aqua Celestia. I'm like... There's no way it's aqua sauce. It doesn't have vanilla in it. Or incense. <laughs> or effort. <laughs> or anything. Uh, is I would lemon mint all year round fragrance. Yeah, you can rock it all year. I don't think it's the best in the summer. But the other three seasons, it does work really well. Best layers to spray for fresh smell. I would go neck, neck, shirt, shirt, back of your neck. And then you can go one on each arm if you want. Or you can skip the arms too if you want. If I had said woods, you probably would have gotten it. No, I don't think I would have. Because I don't think of woods at all in Cedar Rap Bosley. I know there is woody notes in there, but I don't think of woods. Best office fragrances, you could go with Gentleman Reserve Privé. You could go with pretty much any MFK. They're fire. Like Gentle Fluidy Silver would be good. Amorous Ohm would be fire. Um, you could go Prada Lone Line. Intense is the best one. Angel Things for the gift. Uh, you could go Lamale Parfum. I mean, there's just a lot of good ones. Depends on what kind of vibe you want to give off. Closest to Creed. Which Creed, Justice? Like, they have a bunch of different fragrances. Eros, I would go five. Would Vanilla E Super layer well with Kua? Yeah. That actually would be really good. That'd be a good one. Creed Aventus? No, I don't like it anymore, BJ. I used to love the scent. I'm not a fan anymore. Sorry, nubs. What's the title of the video for the giveaway? So it's the only pin. I only have one pin video. Um, so it's the only one. And it's on um, TikTok, though. You got to go to TikTok. So it's not on uh, YouTube, unfortunately. So you have to go over to TikTok, and it's the only pin video. Can you pick my scent of the day tomorrow? Sure. Um, what's the weather? Have I tried Diaz and Durga's Amber? No, I have not. The only one I have is Italian Citrus. Love it. So good. Uh, best clone contact frags. Best close. Oh, close contact. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I swear I know how to read. I swear I know how to read. Um, the best close contact. I would go uh, Dolce & Gabbana, the one EDP. Is 125 ml Herod for 90 of steel. Yeah, but the only downside is Herod doesn't last the longest. I love Burry Hero. Great one. Proud of Luna Rosa Sport. It's okay. I'm not a big fan of sport fragrances. Best top note in your opinion. Ooh. I don't know. Like, Mandarin Orange is always really good. I like Mandarin Orange in pretty much every fragrance. Closest to Creative Ventus, uh, I would go Mont Blanc Explorer. I love that one. But it's more like an inspired by. It's not like a one-to-one. -one. Um, one to one, I hear the um, off non uh, supremacy, not only intense, it's supposed to be really good. Where did I buy all your fragrances? Most of them are Joma Shop. I actually have a deal with Joma Shop where they made a page and I was able to pick out 15 fragrances. If anyone's interested, go to my link tree and uh, it's the first link there. I felt so cool that Joma Shop was like, You want to work with us? I'm like, Heck yeah. What does Mancera have for all year round or summer? I'll go to Drop Baze. I think it's the best one. City Rhythm, I have Miami, St. John, Nashville, and Manhattan. Should I apply by the fireplace? Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's such a good one. I love that one. Like, how long does it last on your skin, Steph? I'll fly to Scotland and give you a bottle of Grand Noir on the 23rd. <laughs> Luke, what's up? How you doing? Uh, yeah, Abrasasi Hoss is right there. Nubs, Arrows, EDP or EDT? I go EDP. EDP is better. Should you... So I don't have uh, By the Fireplace. I don't have a full bottle of that. What's my favorite Lamale Parfum? I already have Club de Nuit. Oh, yeah, Club de Nuit Intense, man. I mean, it's, 
It is what it is. I'm not a fan of it personally, but it is what it is. I just bought 2654. I haven't smelled that one. My favorite rhythm, uh, city rhythm, is Miami. I think it's just, it's special. Jedi, thanks for following. Uh, what does it smell like? So, Rasasi Hawass is like a fresh fragrance with like a hint of sweetness from like an Invictus Aqua fragrance. But it's just a hint. Could you pick mine? I believe the picture of my collection is still on your Instagram. Well, the problem is I can't actually swipe off because I'm using my phone and my iPad at the same time. The lowest is 45. The highest is 61. Um, I'm trying to remember. Cloudy with some sun. Uh, opinion on Instant Crush. I haven't smelled Instant Crush yet. Um, I'm trying to remember. Do you have Halloween Man X or do you have Kamara Quay? Or Qua, or how do you say it? See, right in the Miami smells like the best tropical coconut fragrance. Perfectly blended. Like, it's it's just so good. I love that fragrance so much. 2654 is a blend of Miami and San Diego. Nice. I haven't smelled San Diego. Aqua Department is a nice fragrance. Niche, I think, not popular. <laughs> Back to the question. Oh, my brain's broken. Somehow it unfollowed. Dang, that's weird. I wonder why. You all see the same thing I'm saying. I want bro to respond. Wait, what? Tyler, what, what am I not responding to? See, that's the thing about TikTok. Oh, there we go. Favorite is Zaro. Just bought the most wanted parfum. That's the best one. That's the best one. The most wanted parfum by far is the best one. Like, you got it. I would go Zara the most wanted parfum over starting with the intensity. It performs better, projects. It's just a better fragrance. Baccarat Oud Wood. Uh, what? I mean, Tom Ford Oud Wood or Baccarat Rouge 540? I'm confused. <laughs> A unique summer fragrance. Uh, I mean, Elysium is probably going to be the closest to unique you can get. Um, like, Missoni Way is my favorite, but it smells like Versace Port Homme and Chanel Laurent Sport, so I wouldn't call it unique. Uh, you could go Miami from City Rhythm. That's a unique one. It smells so good. I love that one. Yeah, go go Miami. Marshawn, thanks for following. Yeah, go Halloween Man X tomorrow then. All right, so yeah, first tell me what the temperature is tomorrow and then list out the fragrances. All right, so a niche, I think. Not popular, masculine summer scent, you own it. Basic bottle, top notes, citrus, middle notes, florals, lavender, base notes, oak moss, vetiver, and patchouli. Uh, is this one at least him intense? <laughs> yep, I got it, got it today. Still haven't unboxed it yet. Actually, I'm going to open this package because I keep having to hide my name. And I'm tired of doing that. Oh. Oh, my gosh. I swear. I always have a hard time with these type of packages. Open. See, now you're seeing what really happens when I'm doing unboxing videos. Like, half the time it's me just struggling. And then I just either speed it up or cut it up. Is BR540 have any good dupes? Yes. Um. I actually just filmed and released a video today about one that's pretty good called Game of Spades Rouge. It isn't the most uh, like heavy projector, but it's much more subtle. Beast Mode, thanks for the goof. Dylan Blue, for me, lasts about 8 to 10 hours. When I guess my fragrance of the day, sure. Um, again, I, for me to guess fragrance of the day, or tell you what I think you should wear, I need to know the temperature, and I need to know what you have. Uh... Let's see, it's going to be in 50s to 60s. Kamara, Kismet Angel, Tonka Cole, Lamale Brafam, Lamal Elixir, Lebo, Halloween Man X, Man Hero, Spice Bomb Extreme, Assad, 9 p.m., Dylan Blue, CDM, Dr. Squash, Glacial. Where's your, uh, uh, where's your Bohemian line, bro? <laughs> um... I feel like Tonka Cola. I'll say Tonka Cola or Dylan Blue. That'd be my pick. There we go. Finally. Gentle Fluidy Silver over Galloway. I do not like Galloway. Sorry. I'm not a Galloway fan. Love Gentle Fluidy Silver, though. That is a fire fragrance. Oh, so good. So good. 
So there's my little card from Nevaeh. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. And there is the packaging of the three. But that's as far as I'm going because I'm going to unbox this on a video. I forgot, literally typed it out and then deleted it. <laughs> there you call me out of my favorite fragrance. You want a unique summer fragrance? Get a decant at Kenzo Ohm EDP. You mean that? My thing about Kenzo Ohm EDP though is it smells like uh, Invictus, to be honest. It is fresh. It is beautiful fragrance. Actually, I used to wear this when I would work out or when I would run. And when you run outside and the wind catches this, ho oh, ho, it is magic. I will give you that. Smell good, feel good. Agreed. <laughs> give us a peek. Also, the fragrance was Missoni Wave. No, it was not. Ugh. I'm failing right now. I'm just failing. My brain is shut off. Best MFK, I would say you're, the best one is uh, Gentle Fluidy Silver or Amorous Ohm. On Korean Art Obsession, Lamal Everfond. Lamal Everfond beats it all. <laughs> uh, yeah, Amorous Ohm is probably the best one from MFK, in my opinion. <clears throat> uh, Lost Cherry Knockoff. Actually, Steph, I don't know any ones from that. I don't know any. I, I need to find one. Have I smelled Latafa Nevros? No, I've not. Best place to buy testers. Gentleman Shop has some really good ones. Do I like rice? Are we talking the football player or like the food? Uh, what was the best blind buy? La Molle Parfum. Should I get Mancera Instant Crush? Haven't smelled Instant Crush yet. Do I like Dior Sauvage? Yeah, it's still good fragrance. Still lasts a long time. Uh, so, Kiwi, I haven't smelled Greenly. It's... Right here. Um, sadly, I love Galloway. I don't like. So at the moment, I'd go Sadly first, Greenly second, Galloway last. The temp was warm. The frag is lemony, and I did three, seven sprays. Oh, guess which one you had. Oh. Ooh. Uh, ooh. It's a designer. Oh, my gosh. Uh, deal of the day. I'm selling Nautica Voyage for 300 Limited time deal. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is like a heavy compliment polar fresh fragrance. The so ladies love it. <laughs> it's an exclusive release. <laughs> oh man, if someone bought Nautica Voyage for that, oh, that would hurt. That would hurt. Um, oh bro, I I don't know what fragrances you have. Like, I'm sorry. Uh, a lemon that's fresh for a hot day. Um... Let's go Dylan Blue. Uh, Lamal Navy, haven't smelled it. Review Greenly right now. Kiwi, I can't. Is Neve here? Is Neve here? I mean, bro, packaging's way to go. Um, no, I want to do a video of this tomorrow. I want to do a video. How do I just put the bottle here in my arm and use my finger in the atomizer? Yeah, Neve, thank you so much. Cannot wait. And, bro, I love this. Like, way to go. Stepping up the brand. Like, this looks so cool. Appreciate it. Awesome little card written. I like it. Can't wait for you to smell that. I think it'll be one of your favorites. Awesome. Can't wait. Uh, bu -bu House of Proje Projection Lebo EDP. It's a good one. My favorite rice. Mine is Ray Rice. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, come on. I, I got my got to go with my bro with the Chiefs. Although that being said, Declan Rice is also pretty good, but he plays the other kind of football. NPC fragrances, thanks for sharing. No one will tell a soul, isn't that right, guys? <laughs> Smell it. Ugh, fine. I'm gonna rip this box open. I know I am, and then the whole I'm just unboxing this for the first time is gonna be like, yeah, are you really? Oh, it popped open. I feel like a kid when you like got like your um, your favorite candy that you're not supposed to eat, and you're like, I didn't open it. I didn't open it. You get, like chop it over your face. And you're like, I didn't take. I didn't. I I didn't. I I I I didn't. 
And everyone's like, yeah, you did, dude. You're, you're covered in chocolate. All right. Now, here's the question. I guess I'm doing Greenlee, but man, I'm more excited about the mind game. There it is. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no, we ain't snitches. <laughs> Uh, you know what? I'm going to do it on Nevaeh's card because I think cardboard adds a scent when you use a cardboard. Which is why I keep using my fragrance boxes. I'm not going to lie. I really hope I hate it. <laughs> and I'm positive I'm not going to. There's the cap. Like, Where did the cap go? Where did the cap go? Ah, crap. Ah, shoot. I do like it. I do like it. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. I guess the real question then we go back to, is it better than Sedley? Anthony, what's up? Dang it. I may like this better than Sadly, actually. Oh, shoot. I need to get Sadly out. One second. I gotta get it Sadly. <clears throat> Problem is, I gotta find it in this thing. I don't know where Sadly is in here. I remember what it looked like. Sadly, sadly, sadly. Where are you, sadly? Where is sadly? There's Pegasus. Uh, Viking H24 Ultra Mall. CH Privé, Tear the Mask, Enigma, Tom Ford, and Seven. Oh, crud. Sadly would be at the very bottom. <sighs> and Sadly, why'd you do the bottom? Oh. Sadly. Now, I will say this, though. This is the pre-reformulation, the 2016 badge. Ooh. I got Sadly and Greenly on one thing. Okay. Oh, I think I do like Sadly better. Now I gotta get a bottle of Grinley. <laughs> I think I do like Sadly better. Although Grinley smells a little bit classier. Like, Sadly is that, like, bright, fresh citrus, like, popping in the summer. It just smells amazing in the summer. Grinley smells a little bit more like, um, if I'm going outdoors to a festival concert or something like that, or I'm going outside, I'm gonna wear Sedley, but if I'm going to like a cocktail bar in the summer and I wanna smell amazing, I'd probably get green at that point. Oh, they're both good. But yeah, I think Sedley, oh, I keep going back and forth. I keep going back and forth. Oh, it is good. It is good. I do <laughs> Sedley, 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 Encre Noir. Sedley, 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 Sedley. <laughs> I gotta pretend I'm unpackaging this for the first time tomorrow. It's gonna be fun. This is gonna be fun. Everyone's gonna be like, bro, we were on your live. You already opened it. My favorite summer fragrance under 100, Missoni Wave. Best summer niche fragrance. Um, I still think Elysium. I still think Elysium, but Greenlee and Sadly do have the ability to fight for that. 
Oh, dang, Greenlee's good. I do like Greenlee. I was hoping I wouldn't like it. Oh, that apple is so good. I'm going to wear Greenlee heavily. I actually could see myself buying a bottle of Greenlee now. Oh, Sedley's so good. Yeah, Sedley wins. Sorry, just straight Sedley, Sedley won, Greenlee close second. Oh, oh, so good. Get a reminder that you could have gotten a 2018 Ford Mustang instead of fragrances. But I wouldn't be happy because I have a 2018 Ford Mustang. <laughs> now, if it was a 2018 Aston Martin DB9, then yes, I, I would do that. <clears throat> if I could have a DB9, I might consider. My favorite summer fragrance for under, I already did that one. How many sprays of Missoni Wave? I would go five. Neck, neck, shirt, shirt, back of your neck. You can add one on the arms if you want, but definitely five. Keaton, what's up? Box tour in the shreds. All right, guys, this is my first time boxing in Florida. You know, really. <laughs> Holy cow. What did Nevea do? Look at this box. It's destroyed and it's open. And you can tell it's already been a couple sprays of Grantley. Nevea. <laughs> Oh, that does remind me. I probably oh no, the card came on top of the box, so I don't need the card in there. <laughs> All right, guys, this is my first. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Keaton, thanks for the roses. Dior Ohm Cologne worth it? No, I would get Dior Ohm twenty twenty. I think it's better. Encre Noir. <laughs> <laughs> PT Cruiser give off the same energy. <laughs> oh, when I lived in Denver, my roommate had a PT Cruiser. I was like, bro, why did you get this? He's like, I love it. I'm like, why did you get this? <laughs> I remember I, I used to travel for a living, and I had a PT Cruiser several times as a rental car. First of all, if anyone's never driven one, the, like, stick is, like, horrible. It's in the middle of the car. It's just stupid. It's a button. It doesn't make sense. It, oh, there's so much about it. The stick shift just does not work right. I feel like I'm gonna break it or I'm not even gonna get it to like go into gear. Um, the drive itself is meh at best. Like, that's a terrible car. <laughs> so like, <laughs> thanks for following the channel, everybody. Appreciate all the follows. Oh my gosh, Paradise Garden hasn't come out in America yet. And if it has, I haven't been able to find it yet. Gentle Fluidy Silver is my signature scent, bro. Fire fragrance. Fire. That's a good signature. His real name is Caleb. I love him and his wife. Yeah, no, they're great people. Like, come on. Like, putting this in, like, the actual packaging? Hmm. Yeah, Greenlee is actually... I mean, I've never smelled Greenlee on the day before in my life. Man, that's good. Yeah, I think Sadly still wins, but... Oof. Prime Romo. <laughs> <laughs> One Million Lucky is a good one. I like it. Tom Ford, that make great fragrances. Vanifa Tal is my favorite. Dior Sauvage. Honestly, Dior Sauvage is still a good fragrance. It still lasts long, has good projection, good performance. The ladies still like it. I like it. Tobacco Color, fire. Fire. I love that fragrance. Oh, my gosh. I'd love to get a full bottle of that. Do I prefer Dior Sauvage or Prada Luna Rosa Carbon? I, if I'm honest, Sauvage was my signature scent, so I'm probably going to still go to Dior Sauvage, but Prada Luna Rosa is actually really good. It is really good. Jessica, how are you doing? You're welcome, Lucas. You're going to wake up one night from a nightmare and Ankara and will be standing at the foot of your bed. <laughs> Could you imagine? You just wake up and you're like, oh, please, please don't. I don't want to smell you. <laughs> what am I doing up so late? It's not that late. It's like 11.39. It's not that late. It is 1139. Cheers. I got two 654 Tropical Confessions Miami, and they are all amazing. I can't decide. I, I love Miami. The other two I haven't smelled, but I love Miami. I love your energy. Oh, thanks so much. Appreciate it. I appreciate all the follows. Seriously. Your help helps me out so much. I can't explain it. It helps out so much. Ultra Mall, La Molle Perfum. Get La Molle Perfum. La Molle Perfum. So much better. I got a riddle for you. Uh-oh. <laughs> you will hit your face. <laughs> Um, so out of both, I should buy Sedley. <sighs> I 
Okay, so if you want to be loud, go Sedley. If you want to be more classy, go Greenlee. Paradise Garden is out in America. It's also on JPG website. It's just sold out. I just checked yesterday. It wasn't on JPG's website. So it must have came out today then. Where did I get your shelves? My shelves I got on Amazon. So, put them on Amazon. Opinion on YSL, which one? <laughs> Paradise Garden, haven't smelled it yet. Opinion on Mind Game for Aces, haven't yet. Um, the one that I have, I just got blockade. I need to test it out. I will do tomorrow. Uh, Greenly, honestly, perfect summer fragrance. You can wear it if you want to go like a cocktail bar, if you want to go somewhere nice and classy. It's a great fragrance. I like it. I don't know about performance, though. I just smelled it for the first time. Aqua Celestia Cologne Forte. It's not as good. Aqua Celestia is better. Aqua Celestia is better. Aventus Clones. Ah, I haven't smelled it. I'm not a fan of it. Have I tried Al Haramain Laventura? No. I have Al Haramain Amber Oud Gold uh, Extreme. Holy cow, it is fire. What perfume do you think is similar to The Office by Jeremy Fragrance? Uh, if I were to pick one, I would go Dolce, or not Dolce, Aqua de Jo Profundo. Profundo, right? Uh... is it? I know you're in here. I am making a mess. Fragrance bottles are flying. So that is date. That's not the one I want. Where are you? Oh, there you are. I know he himself says Sedley's his biggest competitor for office. I'm clean there. So I'm trying to decide between Aqua de Jo, uh, Profundo, Absolute. I wouldn't do sadly. I would go Aqua de Jo Profundo if it was me. And I'm not saying that it's going to be like a one-to-one. -one. Sorry, I had to clean it up. It was bothering me. I'm not saying it's like a one-to-one, -one, but it is good. <clears throat> Sorry. So, I, I yeah, maybe Aqua de Jo Profundo. I'm new to your life. Oh, welcome, welcome. Just talking about fragrances. Fragrance that you love, but 99% hate on it. Savage. <laughs> I'm sorry to bother you. Don't bother me. Everything's good. Wait, is it a riddle? Slate? I don't know the riddle. It's my riddle, actually. I, I don't know the riddle. What? I missed the whole riddle. I just get slay. Uh, slay, 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 slay. I think I missed the entire actual riddle. And I'm terrible. I'm terrible at riddles. I tried. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I tried. Uh, best designer, Lamali Parfum. <laughs> uh, I got proud alone. It smells amazing. I'm with you, bro. Would I agree that Legend EP is a good replacement to Percival? Um... I mean, it's in a similar family, but no. I would say uh, uh, it's probably as close as you're going to get, actually. So, yeah, maybe. I'll retype it. How old are you? I'm 39. I'm going to be 40 in, like, next month. Actually, in a month in, like, three days. Should I buy Versace Eros EDP? Yeah. No, I would. Great fragrance. I already got Le Parfum. Um, Dylan Blue. <laughs> I feel like those are the two I just say over and over. Uh, great one, and Victus Victory Elixir. Love it. Love this fragrance. Good compliment puller, nice sweetness in it, the vanilla fire. Abby, thanks for following. There is 500 bricks on a plane. One falls off. How many are left on the plane? Huh. 
Huh? Like, I want to say 499, but that's like the obvious answer, and then for it's never the obvious answer. There's 500 bricks on a plane. One falls off. How many are left on the plane? Well, see, I was thinking none, too, because then, like, if the plane took off, they'd all fall off. But I don't think that's the case. So I'm going to go 500. It doesn't say fell off the plane. It says it said fell off. So I'll pretend 500 on a stack and one fall off, and they're all still on the plane. Going 500. <laughs> I'm terrible at riddles, by the way. I am terrible at riddles. My brain doesn't work that way. My brain, like, shuts down. Vimba fragrance legit. I hear it is. I've never bought from Vimba. I have a lot of followers. I do. You're the one that I blame because now this is my addiction. <laughs> fragrance you hate, but ninety nine percent of people love. Uh, I mean, I hate on Crane Noir. I wouldn't say ninety nine percent love though. It was four ninety nine. Ah, uh, it felt too obvious. Felt too obvious. All right, everybody. I'm going to bounce. Um, I need to go to bed. How do I put an elephant on, in the fridge? <laughs> I have no idea. A lot of people consider chrome as old and cheap, but it works best for me. Hey, anything similar than blue? I mean, aqua de joe is what chrome is kind of similar to. You can go Dylan blue, too. I don't know how you put an elephant in the fridge. Sorry. Um, okay. I, I don't know how you put an elephant in the fridge. Like, I always thought, like, if I was in Lord of the Rings, or actually, technically, it would be The Hobbit, and I was sitting there having to do the riddles with, uh, uh, Gollum, I, I would be in so much trouble. Open it and put it in and close it. <laughs> <laughs> first time catching live oh welcome welcome appreciate you being here appreciate all the follows it helps out so much yeah Astrid, have a good night andrew have a good night i need to go people i really do it is almost midnight i gotta get up early tomorrow busy 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 told myself two bottles every other month i buy two bottles every two weeks that's the problem bro that's the problem i'm telling you i'm the same way I'm on a no buy f until I go to London. And then when I go to Harrods, I'm screwed. <laughs> At that point, it's going to be one of those don't kill a full credit card on Ferguson's. I got to go. Sorry, guys. I got to go. I wish I could stay. I got to go. Have a great day. I'll tell you the real tomorrow. Can't wait. I'll talk to everybody tomorrow. Hope to see you all soon. Have a great night.